Hello guys and welcome back to another Fallout 4 mod spotlight video. In this one we're going to be covering critical hits outside of ads made by not sure 700. Yes, that's the name by the way, it's not because I'm not sure. But anyway, um it's made by not sure 700. What this mod is supposed to do is it's supposed to make it so um you know how in in, in the vanilla game you have this crit meter right here in vets. You see that it says crit in the middle bottom part of the game uh, the screen. And uh, what this mod aims to do is bring back the old kind of criticals that were in the older Fallout games. The ones that were random based on your luck. Every single time you shot, there's a chance you're going to get a crit on an enemy. Uh, and uh, it, it just kind of just adds the whole chance-based critical system back again from the older games. If you never played those, just know that this makes it so in normal combat like this, when you just randomly shoot him, there's a random chance. Well, it's not random. It's based on your luck skill and your perks you have. Which I'm going to go into detail of later. Um, but based on certain uh, certain skills, I guess, or certain statistics you, you have for your character, you have a higher chance to get luck, like get a critical hit on your enemy. Um, I'm going to show it off in a little bit. Uh, this one also works with some of the perks for vets, uh, because this is supposed to be like a, a replacer of the vet critical system it doesn't remove it though there might be another mod i can cover later on that removes the actual critical meter down there in case you want to use this mod specifically um and, and not use the crits at all in vets uh but this is the kind of the middle ground you can still use vets uh crit and you can also use critical shots outside of vets in, in case you want to use both for some reason uh, in any case let's go ahead and see how it works so whenever you get a crit you should get a pop-up at the bottom left corner of the screen now i'm gonna go over here and i'm gonna shoot everything uh, I'm using a weak automatic gun on purpose because I'm trying to get a crit so I'll see if I can't randomly get one here critical strike you see I got one top left right there I'll also go in and shoot some more people just to be safe I'm not gonna shoot you you're too far away buddy up there but anyway, I'm going to go in here too, and then we're going to see how many crits we can get here. You saw I got one crit there, so it's not overpowered or anything. It is, the chance is completely based on your character, and because my character is 5 in everything, my log is kind of low, or should I say maybe just completely average. So uh, critical hits are not overpowered in that aspect. It only happens now and again after like maybe 20 or 50 shots of hitting maybe, depending on your skills of course. And the criticals can also become more powerful, like I said, depending on the perks you choose. If they didn't die that fast, that would be great. <laughs> but yeah, I still haven't got another grid. It's 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 kind of it's kind of crazy how I still haven't gotten one. There we go. Now I've gotten two crits. So hopefully you get that this is balanced and it's not overpowered in any way. I don't think there's any more to really show when it comes down to this. Just know that it works with all your other weapons and such, Shit. so there's no need to feel like it's overpowered or completely unbalanced or remove something from the game. If anything, it takes something that Bethesda took out of Fallout 4 to make it less RPG and edit it back again so Fallout 4 is more RPG. Because now you can make a, um, a lock build or a critical build where you can go ahead and make a build specifically around like getting high chances of criticals on enemies, especially for a sniper build that could be kind of powerful. So it actually adds more options for you as the player. Uh, but hopefully you understand exactly what this mod is about. If you don't, you can always read uh, the actual mod page. Uh, I'm going to put the actual mod in the description below in case you want to uh, check out the mod page and the mod um, yourself. Um, but yeah, it seems like I'm stuck in this loading screen for now, which is fun. Uh, but I do hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. If you did, consider liking, subscribing and sharing. Uh, hope again remember to check out the mod in the description if you want to check it out and uh, I hope to see you in another one of my mod spotlights and um, oh here we go <laughs> my mod spotlights and it's freaking thingy anyway my mod spotlights and let's plays so uh, yeah stay awesome